Hello guys, Rick here again. I'll wait till everybody gets on here before I start the live chats on. <coughs> Excuse me. Hello. Alright guys, um, if you guys remember the last time I did a bottle opener reviews, I showed a Milwaukee bottle opener last time, okay? The older edition. But I did get the newer edition of it. It looks like this, okay? It has a different head on it than the older one. It's more, it's a rounded head than it being a square head. But this one is also a one-way. That means you only can lift up on it like so, all right? The other feature they put on it where the old one didn't have is a can tab, all right, for your soda cans. I know there's some people out there that have problems open up cans. I don't know if I have a can around here. But this can tap opener actually makes it easier for people that have arthritis or whatever. All you have to do is just get under there and lift up, all right? I'm not going to open this because I got a soda right there right beside me that I'm drinking, so. <clears> that would be great for people with arthritis. Another thing that added on here, besides a different uh, handle, okay, this is more of a, a, a uh, almost like an octagon shaped handle. They put an actual round type, screwdriver type handle on it, all right? But they, asshole, asshole, I'm sorry. Wrong word. Um, they also put a wire stripper in the thing, which would be right here, all right? Now, I don't know what's the deal with having a wire stripper on a bottle opener because it's, in some ways, isn't a tool, okay? <clears throat> but, get this up closer so you guys can see it. They also stuck the bottle on it with the, whoop, get my big finger out of the way, bottle on it. Shows you the top popping off, just like the older style, okay? Um, but it's a little bit smaller. On the handle, it says, Warning, not insulate. Always wear eye protection like they would put on a regular screwdriver. Now... It is comfy in your hands. I'm, I guarantee you that. It has a little bit more rubber over mode on the newer one than this older one. But it is a two-step process in a plastic, all right? The white, it would be your, whoops, I'm sorry. The white would be your letterings and your bottle cap. or your bottle cap. Your bottle on the back. And you, it's over motor the red with the for the handle all right um the item number on this hey lacy i can't remember how much i paid for us well i don't want to uh ring a price on it i could be wrong so if you guys want one of these just go to your ebay or amazon which I prefer eBay over Amazon any day. All right. Um, that, that's just my opinion. Everybody has their own opinion on where to shop. 
But the item number for this is 48-22-2000. Okay, so <clears throat> this one that came out in the year 2000. All right. Rust-resistant per protection on it. All right. And it has a hardened steel, and it's bend-resistant. So that's probably what this is, not stainless steel. If I said stainless steel, I'm sorry. <clears throat> um, I correct myself. Uh, again, it does have an integrated wire stripper. And on a, it comes with a limited lifetime warranty. And it is made in Taiwan. So it's not Chinese made, it's Taiwanese made. But everybody rips on a Chinese, shits on a Chinese, saying their tools suck, whatever. A lot of people rip on other things. All right, but the people over across the East do make good tools and certain items. All right, yes. They do get lemons as well as we get lemons over here in the United States. <clears throat> Excuse me. Next would be this patriotic Donald Trump bottle opener, which has an eagle on the front. They, I bought three of these. I sent some out to people I know. It does have replaceable button batteries in it. All you have to do is screw out the uh, six screws on the back, just tear it apart, and just replace these small button batteries in the back. All right? But this has sayings every time you touch these two metal contact points to the bottle cap. I don't know how well you guys could hear this, but I'll give it a shot. One of, my, one of them is you're fired. And I believe I only paid about seven dollars and some cents for this thing, so not bad. So here we go. I hope you guys could hear it. There's one. I think that was the last one. Nope. So, I'm the smartest guy you ever know is the last one. All right. <clears throat> but for all the Trump fans out there, Trump supporters, pick one of these up. All right. Uh, all in all, I do like it. It does work good. I did try it out. I did try. This newer Milwaukee out that does a pretty good job at popping tops off of bottles. It does a pretty good job at stripping wire as well. So if you guys are interested in any of these bottle openers I got here today, just go on eBay or Amazon, pick yourself up one, all right? Or any of the other bottle openers that I got in the background there, as you can tell. Uh, if you guys want to me do a video on all the bottle openers I got so far all together, I will, but I think I pretty much got that covered for people that already seen them, but people that hasn't see, seen them already, I'll do it for if they want me to. <clears throat> so if you like this video, please give a big thumbs up for me. Again, my name is Rick. Subscribe if you haven't already done so, please. Hit that notification bell and select all for me, please. And leave a comment down below. And please keep your comments clean. No troll thing, no hate comments or any sex crap on my channel. I don't put up with that. Till then, I'll catch you on the flip side and stay safe out there.